What's going on YouTube? Giosno right here. So in today's video I have great news for those of you interested in Checkrain, but for iOS 15. Something similar has been achieved by Timstar. We're gonna get into that in a moment. This video is brought to you by Any Unlock, a software that allows you to unlock the screen passcode if you forgot it, allows you to bypass MDM and even unlock the screen time passcode if you no longer remember it. You can even remove iTunes backup encryption. Check the program out in the link below. There will be a giveaway soon where I'm gonna give a few licenses for free. So Checkrain. As you probably know, Checkrain is a great jailbreak, cannot be patched, but it doesn't work on iOS 15 because the root file system on iOS 15 is completely sealed. Now, a couple of days ago, I posted this article called Why Checkrain Jailbreak Doesn't Work on iOS 15 and Will It Ever Work Again? And in this article, I actually explained in depth what's going on and what options the Checkrain team have and so on, but I also covered an important thing that was achieved. Tim Starr, a security researcher working with the Torin team, has actually managed to get a temporary jailbreak working in the way Checkrain works but rootless. So they posted this picture over here proving that they are jailbroken on 15.1 with a jailbreak that is very similar with Checkrain, basically based on the Checkmate exploit. Now thanks to this we know that it's definitely possible to jailbreak iOS 15.1 and 15.2 and 15.4 and this jailbreak might be released in the near future. Now if this gets released it would actually work all the way up to 15.5 because Checkrain cannot be patched. So the the exploit will work basically all the way up to 15.5, maybe even iOS 16 if you're lucky. But at the same time, somebody posted this. It's coming from Saiguza and here they explain on Discord what they've been up to lately. Apparently in iOS 15.3 and 15.4 there were some changes where soft DFU was removed from NLB and so on and they've been working on bypassing that and you know rewriting Checkrain to no longer use the soft DFU. But according to Teamstar, their technique, although very cool, no doubt, it's actually more complicated than it needs to be and comes with several disadvantages. So we know now that both the Checkrain team are still working on their Checkrain for iOS 15, but Teamstar has already achieved a temporary jailbreak similar to Checkrain but rootless. Basically means that it doesn't have root access, cannot write to the system partition, but normally you don't really need to do that. Tweaks can be updated to work from the var partition and they would work normally with no problem. And there is word that this might be released once it's polished. So that's actually great. It does go to prove that iOS 15 can definitely be jailbroken using the Checkmate exploit that was released a couple of years ago. Checkrain definitely would live on. Now the reason Checkrain hasn't been updated yet is because they don't want to make it rootless. They want to make it a fully fledged jailbreak with root file system access, which although very cool is probably not worth the wait. They can just go with rootless, tweaks can be updated and a jailbreak be released for the public. I don't know why the Checkrain team doesn't want to go with the rootless method but Teamstar appears to want to do that so we might get a jailbreak soon especially for the checkmate devices. So yep, thank you for watching I am Geosnow till the next time subscribe to stay updated and peace out.